It is as shocking a video we have ever seen of the recklessness that happens on the streets of Milwaukee. A driver just weaving along outside a middle school, both people in the car hanging out the windows before that car slammed into a school bus. And that crash has left a 15 year old who was riding in that car fighting for his life. Mary Jo Ola live outside of Morse Middle School where all of this happened this morning. Mary Jo, a lot of people in disbelief over this one. Oh yeah, definitely Steve, especially watching that video for so many, it's very hard to watch. The scene is clear here now, but parents in the area say that ruckus driving around the school is unfortunately very common. This time it left a 15 year old and an 11 year old hurt. You can see two people hanging out the windows of a white Kia as it swerves, then slams into a parked school bus on North 80th Street. We've blurred the portion that shows a passenger being dragged across the road. What's going through your mind as you're seeing this? Scary. Scary. Therese Nelson says she was dropping off her kid at Morris Middle School when she first saw the white Kia swerving south on 80th. I see them turn around in my mirror and next thing I know they hit the bus and the passenger was on the ground and the rest of them took off. After hitting the bus, the Kia collided with an MPS vehicle. Milwaukee police says the car was stolen. A 15 year old boy who was a passenger suffered life threatening injuries. An 11 year old boy who was on the bus was hurt, but is expected to be OK. I feel for the person that did get hurt, but they messed around and found out. There has to be a line that's drawn and maybe this will be a turnaround moment for that person. We met Marcia Jenkins as she tried to drop her son off at school. I'm actually happy my son wasn't on the bus because he normally rides the school bus. So I don't know, it was, I guess, God that stopped us from getting him to the bus this morning. Parents tell TMJ4 that reckless driving out here happens regularly. They just don't care. Uh -huh. It's been plenty of times I've been dropping my son off and you'll see the swerving, you'll see okay. kids just doing donuts or teenagers, who's ever, whoever's still in these cars. One time there was a car that was all over the sidewalk. I called, no police showed up. Both Therese and Marcia believe the ongoing rash of stolen cars is a big part of it. Something has to change some way, somehow, something. Milwaukee police are still searching for suspects. MPS says they immediately worked to get everyone inside and contact police. District leaders say because of reckless driving, they are taking proactive steps to install barriers and cameras to keep their sites safe. Back to you guys. Mary Jo, thank you for that.